hello everyone uh, in this video i'm going to explain you about one issue related to pricing procedure so let me check that issue now go to me21n so we are going to replicate the issue first and then i can show you that uh, what is the solution how can you fix it Go to ME21N and uh, give the purchase document type. You can keep it default also to save time. You can keep the default by using personal setting. I'm giving the material which has a valid info record. So once you are given the valid info record and give the quantity, you can see the valid info record is available here. So PB00 based on the valid info record it came. But you are also seeing this PBXX as a new line. So you don't want to why it is coming because one pricing processor is enough for you, which is coming automatically. If there is no info record, PBXX can come. But uh, without a usage, I don't have any use with PBXX, right? Because I have my PB00, but why it is coming, how to find the issue. The first what you can check it. For this issue, I have already found the root cause. So normally what we do, we first we go there to analysis and find your uh, pricing procedure, go to m slash 08. You verify that uh, how is the PB00 and PBXX? It's uh, pretty normal. OK, how it's supposed to be. It's also same way. There are no issue for you. So then we have to go to define condition type. Okay. As of now, I'm using the short uh, method. So let us go with the SPRO path. Material management, purchasing, conditions. Then we have to go to define price determination process, define condition types. Go to the details of the condition types and our condition type is pb00 so first check in pb00 go to details you verify is there any like how we are controlling the data right here if you come to the configuration there is an indicator called exclusion if you see sap standard also this exclusion will not be blank someone has removed it so ideally, we always suggest that whenever you are working in IDS system, in real time anyway, you should not change. We always copy PB, PB00 and put it in our pricing processor, correct? In same way, you have to use this also uh, in real time, how you are feeling. Same way, please do in IDS system or demo system because there are many freshers are going to work on that kind of a system. These kind of issues will demotivate them. It will consume a lot of time. Hmm? Please take care of that one. So you have to select text and save it okay. this should be available so go back now and uh, we are going to me21n so for what we are telling the system that in base price pb00 is the top priority that's what we want to tell so let us see what is available by default for pb double x pb double x to display see exclusion is blank for pb double x this exclusion indicator should be blank for pb double zero the exclusion indicator should be the base price or gross price that one should be available so the priority wise we can how system is going to define it now i'm going to me21n Zero one. Okay, you can see here, I have taken the material which has a valid info record, gave the quantity of uh, 20 and uh, price is 10. You can see earlier you were seeing the PB double X. Now it is disappear. So this is the way, uh, how can you fix different issues and exploring mostly different condition type 
or calculation schema. These two only will play the role. If you get any issue in your future, any project and all, you start analyzing in that way. If I find any suitable issues or useful issues, I keep making similar issues and provide you or keep learning. And whenever you complete the course or provide your valuable feedback, it can be any platform. So if you are watching on YouTube, you can give a comment, uh, the nice feedback. And if you are watching on Udemy, you can give a rating. If you are watching anywhere, not only my videos, any kind of uh, videos or uh, documents, give your feedback. It will appreciate, like it will encourage the content creator. Or if you are giving any good inputs, it will help to improve the content. So there is no positive or negative, I can say. One is going to encourage, another one is going to improve. Please do give feedback always. Thank you.